to my youtube channel once again this is tech pba so in this video tutorial we're going to look at how to connect um, a network printer or how to add a network printer onto your windows 10 systems um, so a network printer is a printer that is um, installed over a network um, using or that is installed over a network so that um, users on that same network can connect to that printer and print through the network so we can connect to those uh, those kind of printers using um, their host names something like the administration um, printer account printer workshop printer or by using the IP address. IP addresses are addresses that computers and computers alike use to communicate over a network, be it a local area network or a wider area network. So today we're going to look at the two ways how to attach, how to add a network printer onto our Windows 10 systems using their host names and then their IP addresses. So let's begin with the tutorial so the first thing we're going to do is to go into the search box and then search for control panel then we'll click on the control panel as it pops up for it to open the window then in the control panel you want to change your view to category and in the category view under hardware and sounds you will click on devices and printers to view the devices and printers that are connected to this particular system the next thing we are doing is to add a printer click on the add printer button um, this is going to do a search for all the network attached printers over our local area network so in this case this um, system is looking for all the printers that are set up on this particular network that I am connected on so it will do that search and if it finds any it will list them in that box but in this case it didn't find any on the network so what we're going to do is to click on the printer that I want isn't listed so in here we're going to select add a printer using an IP address or host name. Um, first of all, we're doing it for adding a printer using a host name. We'll click next. And then the next thing we'll do is to type the host name. If we if we know the host name of the printer we want to connect to, we'll type the name here. And in my case, I know the printer I want to connect to, so I'll type the host name of that printer which is the account printer and then after typing the correct name I'll click on the next button if you are not sure of the name of the printer you can consult your IT administrator or system administrator or network administrator for the name then we'll click next and then it will do a lookup for that particular printer and then the result says that we've successfully added account underscore printer we'll click finish here to close that window so so in the control panel the add the devices and printers window we can see that a printer or a device has been added onto this system which is the account printer and the status shows that um, devices or device setup is in progress which um, essentially means that um, the device is installing the necessary softwares in the background and so when that is done the, the process will be complete in a few seconds yes so the process the device has successfully been successfully been added and then the, the printer is now showing as it should show in the devices and printers. It's the second thing we're going to do is to add then a network printer using the IP address from the control panel window under hardware and sound. So we'll click on view devices and printers. 
from there we want to click on add the printer just as we did for the first process and then we want to go ahead and click the printer that I want isn't listed select the radio button beside add a printer using an IP address or host name once again if you don't know the host name or if you don't know the IP address of the printer you want to install or to add to your system you need to consult your network administrator your system administrator to get you those details from here we'll click on the next button then over here we want to click on the arrow down then select either auto detect or TCP IP device but for the purpose of this video we'll select the auto detect because this is the one I have tested and has worked for me successfully and then from here in the host name or the IP address box since we are using we are installing the printer using the IP address I'll go ahead and then type the IP address of the printer I want to install which is 192.168.0.247 and then um, I'll click on the next button so the print the, the system the Windows 10 system is going to automatically um, search for the printer and then detect it over the network then install it on this PC so so yes it's found the printer and has installed it successfully so I will just go ahead and rename it to a more familiar name so this is exactly the printer I installed on the system so as we could see it popped up over here that the device is ready to be used. So go ahead and click the next button. So as you can see here, this printer is successfully installed, which is actually a wireless printer, the HV Lizard Pro M404 and 405 printer. It's a wireless printer. Let's test our connectivity to this printer by right clicking on it and then selecting printer properties. Here we want to click on the print test page. That should be it. So we we'll click on the printer notification. So as you can see, this is the test page we just sent to the printer. And as you can also see that the printer, the printout has been pushed out to the printer and it's printed successfully. So yes, guys, thank you for watching this video tutorial. Uh, do to subscribe to my channel, Tech PBA, and I'll see you in another video. Thank you and see you. Bye.